thanks for tuning in to my channel. Happy Friday. Today I'm going to talk to you guys about some beauty counter products that I tried. Um, my girlfriend Marie recommended them. I have very, very sensitive skin. It is a combination skin. If anything, it definitely tends to be a little bit more dry, but I have rosacea, so I have to be super careful. Um, I have definitely gotten the redness under control, but I mean, I do have makeup on right now, but even still, you'd be able to see that I have bumps. Um, I haven't been taking any antibiotic or anything for it. I haven't had an outbreak in a couple years, but I am really just careful about what I put on my skin and keeping my skin clean and healthy. So the three products that I have right here for you guys that I have tried, Charcoal Mask, Balancing Facial Oil, and a peel. So, super exciting. I even had Dave try the charcoal mask with me, and we both loved it, and we've been using it. I've been using it more than him, but I like it because, I'm not sure if you guys can see in that photo, but it is a gentle exfoliation, and when the charcoal dries, you can see all the pores, like defined where there are pores or blackheads, and it's really just like pulling out all the toxins that are in there. And I don't know, it's like strangely satisfying to see that. Also, you know, you can feel that the mask is tight when it's dry and I like that. So you wanna put that mask on clean skin uh, 10 minutes and you can use it two to three times per week. Um, it's a gentle exfoliation and it minimizes pores. So who doesn't want their pores smaller, right? It has lactic acid and salicylic acid in it. All of Beauty Counter's products are vegan and cruelty free and they are making way for clean beauty for everybody and for the environment. Um, the charcoal mask is $49. I'm gonna show you guys. This is what it looks like. And what I felt like when I used this mask, when I took it off, I rinsed it with warm water, is my skin felt clean, but it didn't feel like, oh my God, I need to put moisturizer on. Sometimes when I do, um, you know, exfoliating masks, that sometimes they can pull out too much oil and make your skin feel really just tight and dry and thirsty. I did not feel that way with this. Um, so really nice packaging. And like I said, you can use this two to three times per week and you only need to leave it on for 10 minutes. So while you guys are treating your hair on Sundays with a hair treatment, um, you can also be treating your face. So, I mean, Sundays are a great reset day. So, that is that product. Then I'm gonna to talk to you guys about the overnight resurfacing peel. Peels honestly tend to scare me, but Marie reassured me and I use this. Um, I'm just always afraid that my skin is gonna feel irritated, mostly because of the rosacea. Um, this peel is $69, you guys too. And I have to say that, um, I'm sorry, the peel is $63. When I used this the first time, my skin was tingling and that made me a little apprehensive about wanting to use it again. So I just used it once the first week. Then I went back and used it again the following week and I've been using it um, like they say and actually i would say after like my third time using this it wasn't tingling anymore and it was tingling but it wasn't making my skin red or anything um after it, the third time i used it it wasn't tingling i kind of was like oh kind of liked the tingling it kind of felt like it worked so initially i was nervous because of the tingling then i missed the tingling um but my skin never got red or anything. And I really felt like, oh, also I should let you guys know, I've been using all of these products for like three and a half weeks because Beauty Counter says that you need to allow two weeks to see results. So I wanted to do it for about three weeks so that I could give you guys an honest opinion on what I think. So, um, and the whole thing about this is overnight dullness, good morning glow. And I feel like, 
it definitely got rid of the dullness. I can't say for sure if it was just this or the charcoal mask because I've been using all of this stuff, but I will say that this was a lot more gentle than I thought. And I'm probably going to keep using this product for sure because it just, it feels like good. And I feel like my skin looks a little bit more radiant. So I actually really like the peel. I was pleasantly surprised. And that is why I love trying and using products because even though I think I know I may not like a peel, I was pleasantly surprised and I really like this peel. So $63. The balancing facial oil is $69. Um, this I loved. I loved this like right away. This made your skin feel so silky and so smooth. And I am somebody who, like I said, has combination skin that tends to be dry. And I loved it. Let's see if I can open this for you guys. It has a little dropper. Okay, and you wanna use like, they say four to six drops and use it on your skin and your neck. I found that four was plenty for me, um, including my neck. And I also kind of felt like when I initially wash my face and I'm getting ready for bed because I have rosacea and just in general, my skin tends to be a little on the pinker side. I felt like this was reducing my redness. I really, really love this product. I really, really love it. So overall, I think I might be now addicted um, to Beauty Counter. So thanks, Marie. If you guys have any questions about their products, um, even products that I didn't review for you today, and you want to interested in purchasing, um, you can contact my friend Marie on Instagram. Her name is marie.elizabeth.davis. That is her Instagram handle. And also um, her website is www.beautycounter.com slash Marie Davis slash. So I'll write that all in the comments. I'll put it up here for you guys. And she is really knowledgeable and really passionate about this line and clean beauty. And I definitely recommend reaching out to her with any questions. You know, you can check on Sephora and you can check on Beauty Counter, but it's just better to have like a real person that you can talk to who knows the line inside and out. So I would definitely recommend reaching out to her if you have any questions, but I am a huge fan of these. I love it. Um, their hashtag is hashtag better beauty. And it says on all their packaging that they are the leading movement to a future where all beauty is clean beauty. So clean beauty for everyone. Um, thanks for watching. And I hope you guys have a great Friday. Please follow me on Instagram. My name is Amanda J May. M-A-E, and I'm also on Like to Know It Now, and my name on there is Amanda May. So um, thanks again, and I hope you guys all have a great weekend and enjoy these products. You'll love them, and I really think you'll be pleasantly surprised just like I was if you're a little apprehensive. So try to have an open mind. Have a great weekend.